Here I am with Keeper Jeanette at Shepherd's Wildlife Park and with our common marmosets. They're also known as the cotton-eared marmoset for this nice fluffy bit around their ears. As you guys can see, Jeanette is feeding a variety of fruit today. These guys tend to eat all sorts of things in their wild habitat of Brazil in the rainforest. We've got some gum, uh, which they like to lick off the branches, the trees, and some of the puzzle feeders we give them here. We've also got some eggs, looks like what, carrot, beans. Yes, apple as well. Ah. A little bit of lettuce. They love peas and the sugar snap peas they absolutely adore. Oh, that sounds great. And they love this gum. <laughs> I'm actually spreading the gum on the branches so they can actually eat it off that. It's a more natural thing for them to do as opposed to just eating it out of the pot. So this would make them an omnivore. That means that they eat both fruits and veggies as well as um, bugs and insects. They also like to eat little mealworms um, and they'll hold those in their small hands. Now marmosets and tamarins are some of the smallest monkeys that exist in the world. The pygmy marmoset is much smaller than these guys and you can find them over in the tropics house. But here on Monkey Island, they have a nice free ranging area to play around and to make some cute vocalizations. They're also known for their little squeaks and their little whistles that they use to communicate to each other. Let's take a moment and observe them in the trees. <laughs> 